Well, now it may be easy to get a solar eclipse and a lunar eclipse mixed up. Yeah, and KTSM 9 News reporter our Paulina Spencer spoke with a Utah professor who explains the difference between the two. Good afternoon, Paulina. Jasmine and Ian, I spoke with a professor at Utah from the Department of Physics who tells me that during a solar eclipse, the sun gets darker, and during a lunar eclipse, it's the moon that gets darker. Lunar eclipses are when the moon passes behind Earth and is actually in the shadow of the Earth. This gives the moon a reddish color. During a solar eclipse, which is what's happening today, it's the opposite, meaning that the moon is passing in between Earth and the sun, casting a shadow, which in this case will completely cover the sun in some parts of Texas. He goes on to tell me that although solar eclipses are not rare, this one will pass through the continental USA. There's about one or two eclipses that happen every year throughout the world, and they only occur uh, you know, with a certain regularity, but at least we have now the chance of our totality passing through most of the continental U.S. Dr. Basurto also says that a solar eclipse passing through the U.S. is not likely to happen again until the year 2045. And here in El Paso, we're expecting the moon to cover about 85% of the surface of the sun, meaning that we'll see a partial solar eclipse. Reporting in the production control room, Paulina Spencer, back to you.